This is my encounter with Chaotic Gormagala in Sunbreak. But before you see how the fight went, it all started when I was talking to a lady in an Ahabra outfit. She told me to hunt a Gormagala, but said it was different than normal. Of course, when I checked the quest to see what it actually was, I saw that it was Chaotic Gormagala. But I also heard that more Risens were added in the update, so I looked at the quest list and indeed saw them. It was then that I decided to hunt these monsters before my fight with Chaotic Gore. The first one I chose to fight was Risen Teostra. I wasn't exactly impressed at first since it was doing most of the same moves I've seen before, but then this happened. Whoa, okay, yeah. Different move. Okay, that's a different move. I was pretty surprised by the new moves this Tio was throwing at me, especially in its super form. Oh my- Whoa! Okay. It was hitting pretty hard and even fainted me twice, but once I got my bearings, I made a comeback and eventually took it down. Is that supposed to be the rare material for this? Okay, I'll take it. <laughs> Back at the outpost, I noticed something that was never in Sunbreak before. You can select a follower to a company? Okay, I didn't know this. I'm just gonna bring Arlo. Arlo and Fiorain. Once I chose my comrades, Risen Kushala was next. I wasn't expecting much from this fight, but then something happened that quickly changed my mind. Whoa, what? Excuse me? I've never seen that from Kushala. It of course fainted me shortly after, but when I came back, it went into its super form and surprised me with even more new moves. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. Oh. Oh, snap. Uh. Uh. Oh. Oh. I was able to survive the super tornado and keep up with it, but then I made a rusty mistake. Oh! Oh, I got greedy. Once I came back, though, I was able to finish it off. After getting two of the rare materials and checking out the new armor... Oh my gosh! The Risen Kushala armor looks so cool! Oh my gosh, the Risen Teostra looks absolutely amazing as well. It was time to take on the Chaotic Gormagala. I've heard that this fight is unfair, but I don't know how unfair. But MH Swooser kinda like said it was according to one of his videos, but I don't know. Ooh. Okay, he hits hard, he hits hard. Oh! Oh! He's glowing? Oh! Whoa, whoa, oh my gosh. It's going in like a V pattern, that attack. Oh, he was gonna try and pin me! Okay, that moves new. Oh, that's going in all directions. Oh, oh my gosh, didn't know the direction that one was going. What's he doing now? What was that? He's probably like constantly in pain. Oh, I'm on the roof now. Wait, what's happening to that arm? What's with that energy? Oh, he's in that mode. Oh, oh like turning a little red whoa he was gonna pin me again i still don't see how this is unfair i'll have to watch his video after this whoa. oh well i fainted <laughs> whoa what oh what the oh i barely survived the chaotic strongest attack and noticed that i was instantly weakened by the frenzy i had to be more careful if i wanted to beat this monster so that's what he meant by unfair because that attack instantly puts you in full frenzy he's almost dead now oh how long is this frenzy gonna last oh there we go oh my gosh i'm just gonna wait for him to rest and then i'll do a wake up hit Oh, right, this move. Oh, oh. oh my gosh. Oh, I countered to finish. Let's go. There were a lot of close calls, but I had defeated the Chaotic Gormagala. And after the fight, I went to check out the armor and weapons. That's what I figured the design would look like. Weapons. There it is. Oh my gosh, that looks insane. And it has that same negative to positive affinity effect. I need to look at the Charge Blades version, because the Charge Blade one I know very well. Yep, 
Oh man, that looks so good. I know one thing's for sure. I'm definitely going to increase my layered armor. I don't have the leggings quite yet, but from now on, this is what my layered will look like. If you want to see what I did in the updates prior, you can check out this one on the first update and this one on the second update. These are streams though, so only watch them if you have the patience and long attention span.